cucumber. Oh. When I Kate Winslet, keep your mouth shut. See this? I honestly just think about shoving it up my puss hole, so I don't oh, even know. <laughs> This is Sagittarius Shawty. I'm gonna be a skinny queen grocery haul. And let's watch together, and I'm sure um, I'll okay. have comments. I would agree to the motherfucker right now. Don't worry. Oh I'm gosh, she's so vulgar. Um, I don't remember seeing tattoos on her face before. Uh, which did she have make? I, I gotta go back to that video I did. Maybe she had makeup on. I'm literally gonna shower right after this, but. <sighs> <sighs> So she is out of breath. What did she? What did? She, what was she doing? You know, I said this so many times before. Like, I've even dropped like the video. Like, I'm tired of being fat. Whatever, whatever. But yeah, peanut. She's got. But like I said, she's so honest about everything she's gone through. Like, she just doesn't care. And obviously, a lot of people tune in for the train wreck. But <sighs> whatever. I just want to see what she's buying for food. If she was talking about a dirty tin a day, I'd probably be watching it. But I saw it came up recommended. I was like, oh, I'm probably still subscribed to her for all I know. Because why else would I get recommended that, right? Uh, I don't know. But when I saw a grocery haul, I was like, yeah, I want to see what she's buying. <sighs> why is she out of breath? I literally just like lost all my confidence. Like, hey, look at look at moi. I just really want to glow up. Like, I just want to have like a glow up in my life. And yeah, glow ups, glow ups are fun. I decided that I'm gonna get serious about it. So I asked. Um, no, I didn't. I don't think I asked her. Um. Asked her what? Who was she talking about? Okay, so Tatiana didn't nurse. Who? Tatiana is. Who's Tatiana? Sorry, Anybody watch I her? I just broke my nail. Oh no! So did I. I'm trying to get this thing in here. Okay. Anyway, so I just broke my nail trying to get on the elevator. So I'm going to have to make a nail appointment. Um, I second that, Kate. Anyway, so I'm doing a grocery haul today. Uh-huh. Um, what did you buy? Meanwhile, I think I see fruit, Fruitopia. That's a sugary... Isn't that a sugary beverage? Probably not a good choice. And um, Probably not a good choice for a grocery haul for weight loss. I don't know. There was a time when I was, like, so confident that, like, literally I couldn't walk past, like, any mirror, any type of, like, reflection of myself and not stare at myself and be like, bitch, you bad. But, like, now I don't even look at myself in the mirror. I don't even like to at myself in the mirror. Oh, that's sad. Um, and I'm not right, losing what did you any buy? weight. I've just been gaining and gaining and gaining and it's oh, just so sad. annoying. So I got Tatiana to write a grocery list for me that's not only... Let me know in the chat if you haven't already. I haven't been paying attention. What is the, um, who's Tatiana? Healthy, but it's also PCOS friendly. So I'm going to do a haul of what I got. Um, what's that? I know some of this may not be like up to your standards of healthy. Uh oh. This is just what she told me to get. Oh, her bestie. Okay. Okay. So um, hold on. So her nurse, she's a nurse. She's, um, she's. Her nurse told her to buy stuff, but then she says some of these might not be your standard of healthy, which makes me wonder what the nurse told her to buy. Uh, nobody's being dismissive of people that have tattoos. I just didn't notice she had them before. Um, so we got cheese. Um, already. Okay, I mean, listen, moderation. She said to get mozzarella. Mozza cheddar, uh, ew. Shredded I cheese, but... This Mozzarella and cheddar, would those go together? Am I having a mo I mean, I'm not a huge cheese person as it is. Would mozza would mozzarella and ch cheddar go together or am I nuts? Because I feel like they wouldn't in my limited cheese eating. Like I said, I don't really venture out. I don't want like stinky cheeses. I don't want cheeses with shells on them. I don't want cheese with the film. Shredded cheese is cool. I don't know about cheddar and mozzarella together though. This is the only one that I could find. It was mozzarella and cheddar. Okay, next. And I got a second bag of it because Why me and not? Tatiana were supposed to Bogo? make Alfredo pasta together on the weekend, but I actually, they were sold out of Alfredo, so I didn't have Okay, so I feel like Alfredo, Alfredo pasta, I don't know what diet she's doing. Obviously not a low-carb diet. Um, if she's counting calories, I guess she could portion control, but I would portion control maybe pasta with like... A little bit of marinara sauce, maybe some turkey meatballs. Alfredo is just pretty much a fat bomb, so not wouldn't have been my first choice. I got these chicken strips. 
PCOS diet. Is that a real diet, Selena? Thingy. She said chicken strips. Hey, Julia. On the lid. Okay, that's good. It's lean chicken, but I hate prepackaged chicken. If I have to buy it in a pinch, I will. But sometimes I find it to be a little slimy. <laughs> I would rather just make a chicken breast, uh, fresh, make them in bulk, I sous vide them. If you don't know what sous vide is, like I keep saying, I'm gonna make a video. I've been saying it for 14 months because it's just a pain in the butt. Um, I just a fresh chicken breast tastes so much better, and I think they actually, if I'm not mistaken, they will add rib meat to that, and I could be wrong. Uh, and that also grosses me out. It's like, oh, chicken breast. But then it says, with rib meat. And I'm like, why not chicken breast with chicken breast? Just a thought. Um, I don't know if she meant like this kind of chicken strip or... Where does this even go in? Does this go in the fridge? How much does it know? Fridge. Fridge. Yeah, so she put chicken strips. I'm not sure. I would have made chicken breasts. Breasticles all day. I wasn't you know, sure I love if she a meant like breaded chicken strips. Like, no, you know, definitely. Or not, but. I'm going to go with she did not mean breaded chicken strips. And I'm glad you went for the non-breaded. That's just a wild guess. I'm not assu I'm going to assume she didn't mean breaded chicken strips. Because that's no. not really healthy. No. Um, I got turkey. Well, I want to say low carb too, Selena. Um. But she just said we were going to make pasta alfredo. That's definitely not low carb. Unless she's going to use those Nosa noodles. I've had Nosa noodles. They're, bear with me. I don't like tofu. But they're, were well, they tofu with soy? I don't know what the hell they are. But they're low carb. They're no carbs. They're very low carb. I think it's like 20 calories for a bag. When you open them, they smell like rotten fish. It says on the bag, smell is normal, just rinse. And when you rinse them, it goes away. And then I saute them in a, in a pot and then I'll mix it with grilled chicken and it feels like you're eating noodles but you're not and it's like i think 30 calories for the whole bag if you haven't looked them up before try them again when you open them you'll think you're standing next to a dumpster uh with fresh dumpster juice but once you put them in a like a colander and you rinse it off the smell goes away turkey bacon which i actually don't like but you know i next. got she asked me to get codfish okay this is this is going this is sounding bad already Oh, she does have a pink couch. It, doesn't, it looks like What's Your Face's couch, that uh, Trisha lady, when she has her podcast that I stumble upon here and there. Is this she sitting in a pink couch? It's a very nice couch. I wouldn't have it. I don't think I'd go well with pink, but... Guys, I'm trying, okay? I'm trying. So... Oh, okay, Kelly Lamont. Uh, sorry for your husband's loss, and uh, have a good night, and I'm sure we'll talk soon, and uh, relax. She asked me to get codfish. They had no codfish, so I got this and it is no breaded. no so i don't know what she's gonna say about that if she says it's not okay she's gonna say eat. she's gonna say it's not okay it's pretty much a piece of fried fish i mean maybe it could be baked but oh. eat, then i'm just gonna not have it i guess um Bye, Kelly. she told me to get chicken breasts Oh, finally. Okay, I can stand. Listen, I can stand by the chicken breasticles. I'm giving i'm giving sagittarius a win for the chicken breasticles um well, I got some chicken breasts. I got two of them, actually. Uh-huh. I'm not sure if you can put one in the freezer. Yeah, you can the freeze fucking them. Blood. This is why I don't buy chicken that, like... It's okay. Ooh. Oh, God. <laughs> has, she never, has she never prepared meat before, or does she always buy meat in a can? I mean, she's had to have seen meat blood before. How else does she cook? Is that a balcony out there? That looks nice. I mean, oh, because she did upgrade, I think, from... The last time I saw her, she was living, I think, in her, her dad's house in a back room or something with a bunny. Remember the bunny? Uh, but it looks like she's in a, a different house. And that, bal I mean, I think that's a balcony. And it's hard to see, but I feel like that might be a balcony with a view. Well, hello, Sagittarius. Shawty moving on up in Canada. No, I hate seeing the blood. <laughs> I'll take this one, guys. Hold on. Can you put this in the freezer? Oh, it's my pleasure. Hold on. Oh, it's my pleasure to get rid of the trash. I'm going to put um, in the freezer. Bye. Go take care of your kid. Have a nice night. Love you, too. But, yeah, they were two for 20, so I got that. Um, two for 20, so the chicken breasts. Two for 20. That's the... Hold on. No, that's actually really cheap, because I feel like a package of chicken breasts would be, like, 12... Well, I guess it depends on weight. I usually buy my chicken breasts at the wholesale clubs, like Costco, um... BJ Sam's Club and I'll get like a big thing of like chicken breast for $19 but you get I think like 12 or 14 breasts in them that seems expensive but I guess maybe Canada's more money oh plus it's Canadian dollars too right yeah I don't know why there's another bag I literally did only ask for two anyways do we have that one oh 
Then we have... <sighs> What else? Olive oil for cooking. Because okay, I like avocado oil, but olive oil is good. I put olive oil in a... I bought a sprayer from Amazon that you... Uh, have you seen those sprays you pump and you put your own oil in and it does like a light mist? I enjoy those. Supposedly it's zero calories, but I don't believe it. Because I didn't have any of that stuff here. We got some... Is, is peanut gather... Oh, oh th no, peanut's not... Peanut's not leaving. Peanut's just saying goodbye to the dog. Pepper. Um, Some salt. <laughs> Some honey. I don't know why Thanks. she... Thanks, VLR. I love you, too. Put this on the list, but I got... Honey... I guess honey is good for a sweetener, because um, I think... I'm not going to try to be uh, all dietitian here, but I think it, uh, it digests quicker or something. So I did this thing called the 21-day diet for, like, one day. <laughs> it's through Beachbody. I didn't like it. Remember those containers you used to have behind me in the beginning of my reactions? People were like, what are those multicolored containers? And I was like, oh... Um, they're from this diet from Beachbody 21 day diet or whatever or something 21 the 21 day diet and they recommended you use honey for sweetener I don't know what the difference is but I bought a thing of honey never opened it it might even still be in my cabinet honey um another thing I wanted to start is no more pop and no more juice so actually the past couple yes no more pop I want to say meanwhile I see a thing of fruitopia back there I don't think they still made that I thought that was a 90s five drink. days Bunny, seriously? I have actually only been... Guys, only so been drinking a, water. 21 so day fix, thank you, uh, Patty. 21 day fix. Like I said, I did one day. It just wasn't for me, it was too much work. I'm gonna get cranberry juice. No, why are you doing I mean, it's good for UTIs, the cranberry juice, so I'll give her that, but uh, I don't drink juice. I don't like juice, I don't like juice. Uh, unless it's like if I'm having a McDonald's orange juice, on those rare occasions I have McDonald's breakfast. Uh, but I just I don't buy juice because juice to me is just wasted calories. I like my water. Which I also fucking hate. Um, she told me to get low sugar ketchup, so I got. I have oh I have the same one Sagittarius. No sugar added. That is the exact same one I have. Uh, tastes just like regular ketchup, and it's got way less sugar. Did ketchup. So if you guys have anything to say bad about this, oh stevia, stevia. She told me to get stev stevia. Or stevia. I hate stevia. I know I like the Splenda, and this, everyone says the Splenda is going to give her the cancers, but I don't want to hear it. Keep it up the mess out of the comments. Stevia to me is so bitter. The weird part about stevia is people are like, some people find it bitter, but other people are like, oh, it's so sweet, like Splenda. I'm on the bitter train. Does not taste good. Um, it's a no calorie sweetener. Um, I don't know. She told me to get a salad dressing. I'm sorry, Jason. I missed you. I literally, I'm trying to react. So I looked down and up, down and up. So if I missed a question, my apologies. Just put it in again or just tag me. So the orange, um, during your reaction, it's easier for me to see orange. You know what I mean by orange? You tag somebody. Thing that I like and my choice is the Thousand Island one because I don't know. Like no. Uh, it's Thousand Island. Is that? Oh, I'm thinking of Russian ketchup and mayonnaise. Ooh, did I just take a dog out? No, I didn't. Uh, that was a cord. Uh, Thousand Island. I don't like that one either, though. And I feel like that's probably not the best. Who, what kind of nurse is this, Tatiana? <laughs> that's what I like. <sighs> mayonnaise. Sweet coming to get coconut oil. Oh, coconut oil. Uh, I used coconut oil once or twice. It just leaves everything too coconutty. And then they started coming out with studies where it's not as good for you as we thought it. We know how they are. Every three months, something's good for you. Three months later, we were wrong. Three months after that, maybe we weren't wrong. Four months after that, it could prevent this disease. But my only issue was every time I cooked in it, everything tasted like coconut. And I'm, I'm good. Well, again, I'm not sure what that's for. Again, I don't know how to cook, nor do I cook. Okay. She told me to get almonds, almonds so good. I got some... Good choice, good choice for a snack. Uh, nutrient dense. Uh, you just can't get that many because they're very calorie dense as well. But it's a good, it's a good choice for a snack. Almonds, which will go up here. Um, okay, this needs to go in the freezer. MCMXCV. What is that? Uh, is that the year she was born? I can't do Roman numerals. <laughs> Kate, I don't think so. I highly doubt it. I doubt she's here. Oh, she got more, but wait, there's more. Okay, show me to get eggs. So I got a pack of eggs. Eggs are good. Uh, 
Good, you know, good. I mean, they have more protein than fat, but really, protein and, and the fat are actually not that far apart. The eggs I have, I think, are five fat, seven proteins, or is it seven fats, five protein? No, it's got to be seven proteins, five fat. So I only have like two to three a day. Um. Have a good night, Jason, or yeah. a good day wherever you are. What is that thing? A fan? That is a really nice view. I mean, she's got a balcony. Is that Toronto? I don't know where she lives. I'm assuming Toronto. She told me to get... That's more stevia, isn't it? Oh, if I can't Oh, do I it. got more stevia. I wasn't sure which one to get. This is no calorie. Oh, it's also no calories. They're all I no guess. calorie. Spoiler alert. They're all no calorie. I don't know. She told me to get peppermint. It was caffeine. I wonder how she handles her business. Speaking of those nails, uh, Chubba, and I think I asked this question a long time ago with Chantal, like a bitty bitty. How does one do things, like personal things, uh, with nails like that? Free, thank God. Peppermint tea. Not sure why. Green tea. Tea is good, uh, probably because it's an appetite suppressant. Right? Am I making that up? I don't know. I got a thing of green tea. I don't like tea. Which I actually low key love green tea. Nope, um, I used to drink it all the time. Okay. <laughs> she told me to get oatmeal, but. Oh, <laughs> uh, is that the instant stuff? I only eat the steel cuts. I know it's a pain in the ass to make, but it's actually not bad in an instant pot. Uh, one serving, uh, 28 grams of steel cut. I forgot how much almond milk it is. I think half a cup. Maybe a cup. And then I throw frozen, frozen blueberries in. You do 10 minutes on high. It, it um, decimates the blueberries. So they're pretty much gone by the time it's done cooking. Uh, once you when it, once it's done, you let it sit for like a couple minutes. Natural release. Then you release the rest of the pressure. But when you open it up, it's like a purple gloop. Which sounds really gross, I know. But it's actually really good. And then you add cinnamon on top. It's fantastic. I know this is really probably really unhealthy. But I didn't like... What am I going to eat oatmeal alone? And that's also maple and brown sugar. I don't think that's what, uh, what's her name? Tatiana, I forgot her name, who cares? Uh, I don't think that's the kind of oatmeal that she wanted you to buy. Or maybe that's what the stevia stuff was for. I don't I like any kind of tea, Peanut. I don't like any kind of tea. I like coffee. And I've had a struggle this week, but again, we'll talk about that in this weekend's video. I love coffee, though. Anyways, I got oatmeal. Fuck. <laughs> that's um, not the oatmeal. I guarantee you that it's not the oatmeal you're supposed to get. I got... Holy dumpsters! Uh, uh, tortilla, tortilla. I don't know how to say it. I, um, I thought that said dumpsters, <laughs> dumpsters, tortillas. Uh, I can't tell. I don't like tortillas. I like corn tortillas. That's probably a flour one. I like a little corn. Let me tell you the Aldi corn tortillas. I've said this before. I'll say it again. The Aldi corn tortillas. Three of them are 18 carbs. They're six grams of carb, uh, six carbs a tortilla, and they taste so damn good. They're at Aldi. Uh, when you get other ones, they're like 11, 11 carbs for one, which I don't get why. I think they're six. Am I making that up? Yeah, because it's three for 18, I think. Amazing. I don't like flour stuff because the flour stuff ends up having more carbs and calories. Um, just the... <sighs> Coffee's poison <sighs> from my soul. Just the wrap thingies that you people use, or that people use, I mean. <laughs> I exactly, Kate. If they ever start, if they ever start a band, Kate, <laughs> the name of their band would be Eating Oatmeal Alone. <laughs> Is it too late now to oh. <laughs> Well, I'm done it. I know that song, but I can't sing it. She told me to get some of the healthy. Okay. Instant meal thingy. So I got. Hey, Mary, I'm posting the link. These healthy choice meals. Okay. That's lazy healthy. Those are sodium bombs. Um, yeah, I got these healthy choice meals. I got sodium four of them. I got bombs. this one. I got the same one. 
You can make. I know she doesn't like to cook, but she can easily make. Um, she can recreate one of those meals for way less sodium and garbage and preservatives than she's buying. But again, it's not a frozen pizza. It's not a frozen enchilada. So I'm gonna give her a win that at least it's a healthy choice frozen meal. But sodium not the best, especially uh, the bigger you are. The probably she must. I mean, usually I associate obesity with high blood pressure. Oh, uh, uh, does that always happen? I don't know. Bitch, we're being ducks. Welcome to the club, Mary S. Good to have you. But I just showed you. They didn't have a lot of options, but they were sold out of a lot. I just got four of these. Okay. It's so, all okay. I mean, like I said, it's better than whatever, but still. They're so small. They don't satisfy a man of my stature. Uh, frozen meals, but that's so gimmicky like when you back in the day when you first did weight watchers they used to sell it hard like oh we have all these smart ones and you can have all these desserts and all these meals and you'd get all excited the guy can have a lasagna and then you'd bring it home and it'd be like nothing but in when it. you take that break and you come back you better come back smaller because if you come back the same big fat sodium filled whale that you are no one will feel bad for you thanks for the super chat Bahim. big ups to eating oatmeal alone and purple glue wait what's purple gloop <clears throat> Kate, Kate was so excited. I'm not doing anything. What is she doing? Is this video almost over? Oh, I turned off the controls. I can't tell. <sighs> Wiener, uh, she's on bag number four or five. Uh, so far, the only really healthy, healthy thing I've seen are chicken breasticles, uh, the green tea. The oatmeal, and but again, I wouldn't have done a maple brown sugar. The pre-cooked chicken strips is better than nothing. Uh, what else? I think that was it really health-wise. <laughs> uh, everything else I probably would have left behind. Okay. For those of you who pay attention to me, I don't Always. drink dairy milk. So I got dark chocolate almond milk. Okay, uh, I want to buy that so bad, but I don't because this loaded with sugar. Um, it's 100 calories a glass, <clears throat> and I don't drink my calories. Uh, I refuse to these days. I keep hoping that they'll find a way to make it unsweetened. Because like, when you buy unsweetened vanilla almond milk, it's only 30 calories a serving. But I, it's probably really hard to do that with chocolate and make it taste good. But I like bitter chocolate. So I bet they could find a way to make it like a dark chocolate and a bitterness uh, where without all the sugar, I'd probably still drink it, but I'm not drinking it for like, I forgot how many grams of sugar it was, and it was 100 calories a glass. I said, no ma'am, not today. Meanwhile, I scarfed a large pizza earlier, but again, there's a method to my madness, stay tuned. Wiener Wagon, I you, GG, love your bits, keep it up. Thanks, Wiener Wagon, so much for the super chat. I'm gonna wait for the, um, I'm gonna wait for the, <laughs> the graphics so it doesn't interrupt Sagittarius. I still got the pizza burps. I've had one and a half of these of water today. How many ounces is this? 64. Big greasy pizza eating ass. Look at that. Big greasy pizza eating ass. So, how many ounces did I have? 64 plus 32. I had 90, I've had 90, almost 96 ounces of water today. Kind of excessive, but I've been so thirsty. Again, you'll see why this weekend. Thanks again for the super chat, Wiener. I love steel little blueberries. Julie. Pressure cook them, frozen blueberries, add a little bit of milk, add a sweetener if you want it, and the frozen blueberries, close the lid 10 minutes, let it naturally release for a little bit, and then release it again, uh, full release the steam, and it's, it's amazing. I got vanilla almond milk. That I didn't see unsweetened, maybe it was, but I'm not going to rewind. <sighs> she told me to get Greek yogurt. I love Greek yogurt. Oh, it is zero fat. At least I think I see zero percent. That's a good. I love Greek yogurt. A little bit of PB2, uh, and I add some Splenda to it. Um, and that when I used to buy cacao nibs, which I haven't bought in a while, a couple of cacao nibs mixed in, mix it all together. Delicious, high protein snack because it's zero percent fat. It's got no fat, and those are usually low in sugar, um, which you, which is weird because usually low fat they add sugar to it. But the brand I buy from. Um, the warehouse, I think, only has four grams of carbs per serving. It's really good. I know, um, rest I in peace, my yogurt, bladder. But I guess I'll put that in my smoothies. Show me to get butter. 
Really, she told you to get butter, and you bought. I can't believe it's not butter. That's not. I believe that's not butter, correct? Because <laughs> that, that's the whole point of the name, right? I can't believe it's not butter. Oh, it says I can't believe it's not butter. Does that <laughs> correct? And it's not butter. Whoops. Oops. Oops. But I got that. Italian sound. Those nails giving me ALR despectful Snapchat vibe. Oh, I loved that Snapchat. That's almost been a year. Thanks so much for the super chat, Italian. I'm gonna sip my water while I wait for the graphic before we continue. Stab some of my water drinkage. <coughs> Ooh, Bobby Brady moment. Big greasy pizza eating ass. Look at that. Big greasy pizza eating ass. Literally, Kate is just here for the graphics. Uh, sometimes I add vanilla extract and cinnamon when I cook it. Cook what? Oh, the oatmeal, yes. Uh, I'll put cinnamon after it's cooked. Um, she told me to get hummus. Oh, wait. I Feta love hummus. Cheese, so okay. Like that. Uh, Again. Was it fat free? Probably not. I love a hummus. Make your own hummus. Chickpeas, olive oil, salt, pepper, garlic, and lemon juice. I mean, garlic is optional. In a blender or a food processor, your own garlic, your own hummus. Delicious. Better than the crap you buy in the store. And I don't know what the hell that's for. She told me to get hummus. I love hummus. Mm. Again, I don't know what that's for. Uh. Vegetables, it's good on carrots. Uh, maybe celery. I don't usually, I usually only put it on carrots or I'll put it on pita. That's about it. What else do I use hummus for? I haven't made it in a while. Oh, cherry tomatoes is really good with hummus. I don't think broccoli is. Um, carrots, cherry tomatoes. I feel like there's something else I'm missing. I maybe I didn't put celery. I think that might be gross. I don't know. I don't think I like hummus, but you know, whatever. Hummus is good. Oh. Whatever Tatiana says. I got stuff to make a salad. I got broccoli. Oh, she bought. I, okay, so here's the here's what I don't understand. <laughs> okay, she buys the pre-cut chicken. She buys the healthy choice meals. She buys a bunch of other crap because she's like, I don't feel like cooking. I don't know how to cook. I don't want to cook. She then passes or bypasses all of the frozen veggies that are just microwavable steamable and she buys fresh broccoli Girl, what are you gonna do with that i guarantee you that broccoli is never gonna see a frying pan it's probably gonna go in the garbage i'll be shocked if it doesn't i don't i even i don't buy fresh broccoli it's a pain in the ass just buy the steamables and you just throw them in the microwave and boom five minutes you're done i got more salad stuff i like romaine <laughs> i got celery Actually, there's something I want to do. Angel Wings. Um, it's a vegan recipe. I'm not going vegan or anything. But I saw something. What the hell was it? I think it was a Tabitha Brown. No, no, no. It was another channel I came across. These two lovely women who I think live locally. Uh, the Brazil Twins or the Brazil Sisters. The Brazil Twins. I don't know what the hell their name of the channel is anymore. I don't want to say what it is because it sounds disgusting. But they made it sound really good. So I think I'm going to try it. But stay tuned. <laughs> Kate, you think she will? I was thinking she could have put it other places, but I prefer to think of the bong, so thank you for that. That's a much better image. I love that damn view. Um, Tatiana, got... apparently Auntie Tatiana's her best friend. Tatiana's a nurse, and Tatiana guided her on the shopping spree. Cucumber. Oh. When I... Kate Winslet, keep your mouth shut. See this? I honestly just think about shoving it up my puss hole, so I don't oh, even know. <laughs> Never mind, Kate. All taken care of. I don't think I should have said that out loud. I'm not going to shove it on my post wall. Don't. Uh, can we take odds on that? Who wants to take a bet? Alright. Oh, she's such I've a mess. Some lemons. So I'm going to like cut up the okay. lemon and like uh, put it into my water when I drink it. Uh, I just... Plain water ice. You can hear the ice. Just that's it. I don't like flavored water. And she told me to get limes. Again, I have no idea why. What are you going to do? I'll oh, probably put it in your water, I guess. Or in your we meats. That one. She sure did, Bahim. I can't with her. Even a grocery haul has got to be an OnlyFans extravaganza. Bless her. And then we have... My back is itchy. 
I agree, Celine. I'm glad Tatiana is helping her out, but I do question some of the choices that were made, but I have a feeling they were not Tatiana approved choices. I think they were, I don't care, I'm just going to buy this choices by her. And I think Tatiana probably sort of was like, girl, what are you doing? Then we have. She has an OnlyFans, or she had one at least, right? She definitely used to. Grape. I love a grape. Do you ever have the cotton candy grapes? So good. Um, we have apple slices. Love apple slices. There's a lot of sugar though, so you gotta watch out with fruit. I'm not saying fruit's bad. I'm not saying fruit's bad, but I just fruit to me is a moderation thing. I know it's natural sugar, but sugar's still sugar. It's better than eating a candy bar. I mean, candy bars are better tasting wise, but in terms of the kind of sugar, of course. But you know, you can't sit there and eat that whole container of apples. It wouldn't be good. Oh, Kate! Saji would do it, then put it back in the fridge, and Tati would eat it. Oh. One sec, I'm just gonna put. Where the hell am I supposed to? Are you kidding me? Is she in the fr Hold on, I just realized something. Hold on. That looks like a kitchen cabinet. Is there a fridge? Because <laughs> where is she putting all the refrigerated stuff? Unless maybe it's... That looks like... Oh. Interesting. I just noticed that now. Where's all the frozen stuff? It looks, is she putting it all in the cabinet? Does she know how to grocery shop? Was this her first time? Um... Okay, I got strawberries. They're so small. They're tiny. They're so cute. Little strawberries. Who knew? I got strawberries. Blueberries. I didn't know it was this small. I should have got more. Blueberries are good. A lot of antioxidants. Again, shocked that she bought fresh and not frozen. I got spinach. I got I love spinach. One of those. Oh, uh, already made to eat Caesar salad. Probably not the greatest, but it is what it is. Make yourself salad thingies, and then I got another. You know, yeah, I feel like you overpay for those. You could just buy a bag of lettuce, uh, uh, a jar of, of low-fat Caesar, and just buy all the fixings and just make it yourself. And the price you spend for that, you could probably make like two or three salads out of that. Maker. The camera's in the cabinet with the door open. Oh, Behem, I'm so stupid. Thank you. So the fridge must be on her right side. Okay, got it, got it. Yourself a salad thingy. Or she's putting it on the counter, maybe. maybe. And that's it. Yeah, that's it. <sighs> Sorry, I'm sweating. Sweating for okay. putting groceries away? Well, then I am glad you are starting a weight loss journey because that is a bad sign. Um. Worms? Why, Chubba Mama? Those sounds get you worms. Why? I do not know what the fuck. I'm gonna wear. I'm gonna put all this shit. Okay. All right. Well, this was lovely. Are we done? <laughs> okay. Are we done? Um. Okay. Why do people recognize her? Does tuna go bad? Yes. No. Not in a can. No. Tuna cans? I mean, yeah, years. Fresh tuna. Okay, okay. Fresh tuna, yes. Uh, albacore. Like, uh, I love a tuna steak. But uh, you know she didn't buy albacore. She's probably talking about the chickens of the seas. The Jessica Simpson special. Okay. Oh, did I've she show us the bread? I've had this bread since I moved in. Oh. Okay, that's probably got mold all over it. I don't know why Lord. it's not moldy. I'm sure it is. Um, Look closer. I don't like popcorn. Look closer. I don't do popcorn in a microwave bag. I heard that gives it the chemicals and it gives you the C word. Uh, I like a hot air popper and you buy the little kernels, the little uh, Orville Redenbacher kernels, and you hot pop those popcorn kernels and it's way better for you. No oils, no chemicals in the microwave. Oh, these go in the fridge. This goes in the fridge. Oh, I hate when you get to the point of the coldest water bottle. And this goes in the fridge. Where the straw is no longer reaching your water, and you have to do that weird neck thing, that I'll, I'll just I'll save it for after the stream. Um, excuse me. Hey, Sarah Butler, how you doing? Does tuna go bad, Kate Winslet? I'm surprised she didn't make that into a puss puss joke. Ugh. I do not have any room to put anything. 
Okay, now I'm gonna put that like that. Okay, uh, let's see how much le <laughs> longer is left. <laughs> Get away from mommy's feet, please. Oh my god, why does she have so much time left? What is she doing? I'm away from so mommy's much. feet, please. Oh, the buddy's there? Alright, I just okay, um, sped it up. Um, honey, Moving back to oh. Texas, you know what that means, Sarah Butler? What a burger. Oh, I'm so jealous. Over here. Nope, not fitting. And then the olive oil can stay on the counter. That stuff can stay on the counter. Pepper. And then. All right. Well, this was lovely. Bunny. I'll leave the bunny alone. What's Glenn doing? She's still back there. She sure is boiling that bunny. All right, well, oh, I think this oh, is it. Oh, 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 my nail. Okay. Okay, yeah, so that's the end of the grocery haul. Okay. Um, we're going to start doing some at-home workouts, too. So I'm about to buy a yoga Ooh. mat online because I don't want to do Oh, I got to buy a yoga mat. Peloton has great um, yoga classes, and I really want to take them. Uh, Jordan's um, fiancé takes yoga, and he keeps telling me to join him in a class, but I need to buy the equipment. I always wondered if the straw was extended to the bottom of the bottle. Those water bottles kind of sound like a ripoff unless these... Well, interesting is they don't come with the straw. At least this one didn't. I had to buy the straw and then you have to cut it at an angle. It does get to the bottom if I... I could juke like that, but this way, I got nothing. Oh, my hardwood. But let me tell you, I put this ice in a long time ago and you can still hear the ice is going strong. Four. And then... Uh... Sorry, I just broke my nail, so I have to go message my okay. nail lady ASAP, because, you know. Okay. Bunny! Peloton is not oh, a sponsor, okay. but let me tell you, Peloton should be a damn sponsor. I have been riding those machines harder than Sagittarius Shorty rides men on Tinder. I don't care if that's a tasteless joke, she will say it herself. I mean, those the, the machines are amazing. I am just between my treadmill, that bike. I'm telling you, if you are looking to get into fitness at home, just the classes are amazing. Everything just... Oh, I love it. I love it. Now, can I get sponsored by Peloton? Okay. So, yeah. Um, if you guys have any suggestions for at-home workouts for beginners, um, feel free to comment. This is the start Peloton, of the new journey. Get a Peloton. And gonna say some shit like if you can upgrade that condo and have a view like that, you need a damn Peloton. Like, oh, like, yeah, you're not... I put the Peloton on the balcony. Oh, then you have to move it in when it rains. I'm gonna do it. Da -da -da -da. Please, like, keep your shit to yourself because, like, I'm... Chubba Mama, if they have affir affirm financing, 0% interest, you can pick up to like 36 months. It's amazing. I'm ready to make a change. I'm tired of being in bed all day, fucking depressed as shit. Wiener. <sighs> so, yeah. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Okay, well, uh. Well, that was interesting. I like her. She's a mess, but I enjoy her. Uh, I think most of her um, grocery haul was okay. Like I said, there were some questionable choices in there that I wouldn't have made, but she did them. <sighs> she mentioned not putting an English who Oh, God. <laughs> uh, I think you can say those things. I can say them about her. She'd probably laugh. She'd be like, you're right. She she would she'd ask she'd be like oh this Peloton I'd be like no sweetie Peloton is a machine <laughs> and it does not vibrate you can, you could sit on the treadmill but then you'd probably go flying off and it would be a really um it would be really sad <laughs> I don't think you'd want to try that 